Hi guys! So, oh my gosh, it is so cloudy and so cold outside. It is raining non-stop. It is like raining hard, and I mean like pouring down. So, that's why it's really dark in the house, and I think the bathroom has the best light, I think. I still look kind of orange though, so. I don't like to look orange. I don't normally look orange. But oh my god, I am so fed up with living in this apartment. Like, it is redonkulous. Like, phew, my hair is being retarded. I'm just gonna like hold it back. So, yeah, hey. Yeah, I'm <laughs> just kidding. So, the people here are redonkulous. I do not like them at all. And, fuck you, hair. And so, let me tell you a couple of stories of why I don't like this apartment. One, there's this jackass that parks right next to me and who blasts his music every day, every night, every hour, like whenever he comes around, it could be like two in the morning, three in the morning, he'll blast his music so loud and his bass will be up so high, my walls literally are shaking. I'm not joking. I'm seriously not. My walls shake. And it's just so obnoxious and he doesn't turn it off. He just leaves his car on. Leave the lights beaming through our windows, leave the fucking volume on, and no one's even in the fucking car, but it's still on. And I'm just like, you son of a I don't like them. And I swear to God, if I ever actually see them, then they will regret it. But they're big and they're black, and I'm just, not to be racist, but they're scary looking. I mean, yeah. They look like they can kill someone. Anyways, another reason why I don't like this apartment is my car got uh, broken into a few months ago. All the doors were locked, but it got broken into somehow. I don't think they stole anything though, but everything was like messy and like thrown everywhere and stuff, so that's a scary thought. Um, just like a week or two previous to my car breaking into, before that, um, the car that parked in the same spot I did was broken into, windows were smashed, tires were slashed. And I'm like, okay, that's not good. Um, what else? Oh yeah, there's people that have been breaking into the apartments around here. Like, th this apartment complex, but other people's places. They've been breaking into them. Uh, so, we live in like a very ghetto area. Like, yeah, very ghetto area. And it is horrible. Like, me and Brian just want to live in a in a nice place and hopefully next time we move sometime in May we can afford our own uh, possibly get something cheaper if we have to move to another apartment but we would really like to live into an actual house like have our own house together and everything I want a freaking office so I can make my videos in there film in there and not be bothered or bother Brian and Brian wants a man cave <laughs> I think a man cave would be fun and oh Oh, I also hate this apartment because they have paper thin walls. Like, seriously, someone's, um, our neighbor will be coming up the stairs and walking into their house, unlocking the door. I can hear them unlock the door from my bedroom. I'm thinking someone's coming to my apartment. So I get up, I'm like, what the f who's coming in? And they shut the door and I'm like, no one's coming to my apartment, it's someone else's apartment. So everything here is just paper thin. They can probably hear me talking. Because I can hear them talking like whenever I go to bed. I don't know what they're talking about. And sometimes I hear noises. I don't want to think what those noises could be. But it's really gross. Anyways. I don't like this apartment. And I have heard noises. Like in my previous video I made a joke um, about my paranormal activity experiences. But I have heard strange noises in this place. But nothing creepy like that. Like it's, this place is possessed. Just weird cracky noises. Probably from the vents when they're dumped there. Air conditioning, how the vents just kinda make weird. I don't I don't know what it is. <sighs> I can go on and on this. There's a huge list of everything I hate about this apartment, this apartment complex, the fucking workers that suck and can't do anything. And mm, I'm just gonna stop. I will stop just for you guys. But oh my god, I cannot wait to move. Can you guys even see me? Cause I'm just like going like this, and I can't even see. You can see me? Can you? Yeah, I think you can see me, right? Okay. 
so that's all for ranting now I mean that's all the ranting I'm gonna do now so I guess I might as well go play Pokemon or the Sims or Mortal Kombat or something and wait for Brian to get home and go get me food because we have no food here and I'm starving all I had today was toast and that was like at 10 a.m. and it is now like 2 or 3 and there's like no food I'm gonna go shopping. <laughs> I'm gonna die of starvation. <laughs> guys, I can fake cry. I don't wanna do it right now because I have makeup, but I'll fake cry for you guys one day. I'll make it look realistic so you won't know the difference. Okay? Okay, oh my god, you know what? I'm just gonna end it here. So I'm gonna uh, talk to you guys tomorrow, and I hope you guys have a great day. And I'm sure I'll complain about something else tomorrow. So goodbye, have a good day. I'll see you tomorrow. Good. I don't, I need a catchphrase, you guys. What should my catchphrase be? Good luck, good luck, good day, good... I don't know, I'm gonna think about it later. Okay, bye guys, bye.